Running out of space is and has been an ongoing issue for the Austin Animal Center as they try and look after the cats and canines already in their care and new drop-ins. 45 to 65 intakes a day, says Mary Brown, a program manager at the shelter. Shelter intake wise, about 65% of our animals are stray animals. And prior to the new finder to foster program, even if you found a stray and were willing to care for it while seeking out the owner, you wouldn't have that option. We always had to have animals complete their legal stray hold on shelter grounds for 72 hours. It can just add all these extra steps. And it means that dog or cat is taking up kennel space during that time period. This is a current look at intake capacity according to Austin Animal Center data for small dogs and then medium to large dogs. Both are in the red, which means emergencies only. So where our main challenge is with our medium to large dog population, we always struggle with kennel space at the shelter. Under the new program, after registering a stray animal with a shelter and getting them necessary medical care, that 72 hour hold can start in the comfort of the finder's own home. We can save that kennel space for those high priority emergency cases and then stray animals can be in their area where they likely got out close to their home and it gives the animals a chance to be able to find their owners.